Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to Riata Horsemanship. I'm Luke Brown, and today is Thankful Thursday. Wow, do I have a lot to be thankful for today. And before I talk to, about that, I'll let you know the horse that I'm riding. This is Theo, and she's my two and a half, the two and a half year old quarter horse mare that's been with me for a month, and, and I'm actually doing one session a week with her for the next month. Uh, her owner wasn't able to come and pick her up right now, so we're going to keep her here and just do one session a week to keep her tuned up and advance her a little more. And then she'll be going to Colorado. She's going to Colorado for our lambing slash calving season uh, training with, with a couple of horses that I'm taking up there. I'm excited that Theo gets to be one of those horses that goes with us, and she is just coming along so well. She She's had a few days off and just picked right back up and... I'm reminded of something that Pat Pirelli said one time. He said, if a horse really learns something and they're relaxed to it, uh, and yeah, they truly learn something, aren't forced into it, but they learn to accept something, uh, they, will, they will never forget it. And that can go negatively or positively, but hopefully if we give our horses more and more positive experiences, they will not forget those experiences, and they'll just become a better and better horse and can have more time off without having to you know, keep them tuned up. And uh, today for Thankful Thursday, you know, last weekend we had our Riata Horsemanship slash Lady Horse Boss building the foundation of your dream horse clinic part two. And it went really, really well. I'm so thankful for all the participants that came and also for the hosts. Uh, last weekend, the host was Superstition Stables out in Apache Junction. What a great place. They've really made a big change in those stables. The new ownership last couple of years has made a huge change with those stables. And so if, you, if you're looking for a place to board, Superstition Stables is a great place to be. Uh, the, the ownership is awesome. The people working there are awesome. It's really a neat place. And you can ride right just to the north, right into the... Uh, into some state land and then out into the superstitions and out down to the Salt River. There are lots of places to ride from there as well as they have an arena and two round pens. So what a, what a wonderful place. I'm so thankful for them, for Superstition Stables, for the ownership, for taking the chance on me and, and doing a clinic there. They hadn't, there. they hadn't done clinics before there and we, we were the first to do it and hopefully we'll have more there and they'll be able to host other people there. Uh, it was it was a lot of fun and thanks to all the participants there were nine people that rode horses <clears throat> we did a lot of groundwork we did a lot of riding i feel like everybody got their mo their money's worth they they worked really hard um, they were exhausted by the end of the first day they were really exhausted by the end of the second day and it, it just went so well and i was so pleased and happy to have been um, in that experience with them with all the the participants and the Riata Horsemanship and Lady Horse Boss uh, Horsemanship Clinic. And uh, I just wanna thank you, thank you to the participants, thank you to Superstition Stables. And last but not least, <laughs> I wanted to thank PNM Arena for hosting the clinic a month ago. So on the 27th and 28th of February, we had a clinic at PNM Arena and that went over really well. We had eight participants and we had some uh, some some observers, some auditors that came and. And just had a lot of fun there. And PNM Marina has always been really good to me at Riata Horsemanship. And I want to say how much I appreciate them. And if you if you don't have a year membership to PNM Marina, make sure you get a year membership. There's a family membership or a single membership, and you can get it for a full year. I think a full a full your a family is like a hundred bucks. I'm not sure. I'm not exactly sure, but I think it's like a hundred bucks for the whole year. You can go and ride there anytime as long as they're not clinics or, or ropings or anything going on but you can also participate in some of the events for a discounted price p p and m arena in apache junction or it's really in a mesa address um off of brown and meridian i think and and then superstition stables great places thank you guys so much thanks to the ownership thanks to the people that helped out that volunteered that came to audit and also last but not least and especially the participants for being wonderful people, wonderful horsemen and horsewomen and for working hard to improve your life and to improve your horsemanship. Thanks for listening everybody. Have a wonderful day. Until next time, be thankful, live with purpose, live with passion and as always, stay safe in the saddle.